Good morning, guys. Happy Sunday. Happy Mother's Day to all you moms out there. If you're not a mom, but you're sitting next to your mom or you're in the vicinity of your mom, tell your mom right now, Mom, I love you. Thank you for everything you do for me because they're amazing and you wouldn't be here without them. So it is Sunday, it's Mother's Day. Um, we slept in a little bit, you know, long day yesterday. We were up early and we were out and about for 12 hours. Um, and then I was, my, my sleep schedule has been wrecked all week. So I definitely, uh, obviously needed some extra sleep because I slept in a little bit. Um, but it's about 9, 9.30 and uh, Tiff's upstairs showering. I think Sierra's doing the same. Bryce is outside doing some chores, uh, mowing the grass. He'll be taking care of the pool because Tiffany wants to hang out out back by the pool on her Mother's Day. It has begun. We've got some bacon and some country potatoes. Tiffany's chopping up some vegetables for her omelets. I'm making those last since they don't take very long to cook. What do you got? We got bell peppers, mushrooms, spinach. What else? I don't know. Three chilies. And chilies, mm, yeah. Nah, not a fan of tomatoes. No. Trying to make a little assembly line here. I've watched enough chefs at restaurants to do this, so <laughs> try and do it. I messed up the first two omelets, like they broke apart and everything. I thought the smaller pan would be better, but now I'm thinking the bigger pan might be better, so we're gonna do Sierra's in the big pan. I'm trying to experiment here. I love omelets, eggs are my thing, so I don't mind cooking for the family when it's this. I just need to figure out the process so I know how to do it and not mm -hmm. make a mess. Yeah. So that one right there is about that you folded as prices. That prices. It actually looks perfect. The way you flipped it was perfect. You guys should have seen it. It was like... Third time's the charm. Yeah. I'll, I'll record you doing this one. See what happens. Is right. it anything? So we're going to do yours in this bigger pan and see if it makes a difference. Okay. I was thinking it would be too thin, but now I'm thinking it might be just perfect. I don't know. That one's pretty perfect. Yeah, that one is good. Mine's just got bell peppers, no mushrooms or spinach. And bacon. I'm gonna add bacon, yeah. Alright. Bigger pan. Nope! Oh. <laughs> Almost. Almost. You see how fast it was cooking? Yeah. I knew I could see it on the other side. Alright, here we go. You guys ready for this? I'm so excited. <laughs> ready? Uh, it broke apart a little bit, but it looks pretty good with the cheese on top. You put extra cheese on top. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bryce is the one that probably turned out the best as far as like, it looks. like the way it was flipped. It flipped like perfectly. That. I put the ingredients on too soon. That's why it like sticks out like that. Yours was actually not bad either. It kind of did double flipped, but it was bigger. Mine was the hot mess. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what's next? Mother's Day gifts. Gifts from the kids? Kind of, yeah. All right. Who wants to go first? Uh, you. Mine first, yeah. Sierra first. Kind of All right. Aww. Got a card? Aww. Love you. <laughs> what? I don't, I don't oh, know what you Yeah, I know. I was like, wait. Oh, She's almost as tall as you. She's almost as tall as you. Like, like no. yeah. It's awkward. I hug someone. All right, Bryce's turn. I have two. What part of it? So. Oh, purple. He's yeah. my favorite color. So, um, yes. recipe for a loving mom. Aw. Good cooking, caring, giving, loving, smart, sweet, Did you awesome. come up with these? Uh, yeah. Kinda. Well, everyone thought of the same things, basically. Oh, okay. And then... I the E. <laughs> <laughs> oh, awesome. That's cute. My, all of the And then, oh, we made... Did you get to pick the color? Yeah. Then you well, no, this... There's just a whole charade of, like, a whole charade of colored beads and different beads. And I, was, and I was starting to just do like random. And then you're like, stick with purple. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then um, you get to pick the color of like it. this. And this is the popsicle stick and we wrapped it in tape. Wow. Okay. And then I colored this and then she laminated it. Very cool. Oh, it's like a tile, I think. It's okay. ribbon. And you chose the color of tissue paper too? Aww. Yeah. So cute. And then she like sprayed it with some type of thing. So the it stays. Yeah. Oh, is it a coaster? It can be. Did you come oh, up with this? Be. Yeah. Yeah, I saw everyone was all different. Like some people had rainbows and pictures of their mom, like that was neat. Big heart. And then purple horns. And then red and purple little horns. What's the date for? Is that Thank you, Betty. Mother's Day. Five thirteen twenty eighteen. 
Here, I'm gonna find a spot for that right now. I hear lots of giggles and laughter. Let's see what they're doing. Oh, oh now I hear no stop. Oh, the fighting's gonna start. Oh, where's the giggles? Where's the giggles? What are you guys doing? We're wrestling. We're wrestling or something. No. Ow. And pinch each other. No. Bryce is supposed to be getting dressed for the day, but he's getting a little distracted. <laughs> You're silly. Now go get dressed. That's what I'm trying to do. So we found our way to a little park here with a grass volleyball court. It's pretty awesome. We have sand in our neighborhood and uh, well, sand's hard to play in and it's not kept up with groom. So there's all kinds of sticks and thorns and what yucky stuff. It? But this, this is pretty nice. This is grass. So we're gonna give this a try. That's what mommy wanted to do. Play some more volleyball. All right, so it looks like we're gonna do girls versus boys again. Bryce, another, another, uh, another repeat domination? Yeah. Apparently the girls said the sand was what was holding them back, so because they were grass, it's gonna be different games. Here we go. home and back in the kitchen starting to put dinner together it's a crock pot meal yep see I picked it out I said pick me out a Mexican crock pot recipe what should pick out Mexican lasagna Mexican lasagna sounds amazing so these are all the ingredients we're putting together taco seasoning sour cream cream cheese salsa lasagna noodles two different kinds of cheese cream cheese onions we need to start oh what are you doing Sour cream, cream cheese, and taco cream, and beans. And beans. That's gonna be like, kind of like our sauce. I'm gonna layer yes, it. Sure. Cheesy sauce. Like grounding it up. And then you'll have to like flip it. Keep it together. He's not usually in the kitchen with me. Sierra knows how to do this, obviously. Starting to layer the lasagna. It's kind of fun, right? Got half a smile now. I enjoy it. Uh, maybe I'm weird, but I enjoy cooking for my family. No, that's not weird. I enjoy it. That's what makes you a good mom. Mm, good try. I like cooking too and baking. Which means you'll be a good mom one day too. I said, I asked them, have you ever tried a noodle <laughs> without it being cooked? Yeah. I tried it at someone's house because they do it. Oh, crunch. I sounds like, like you're like, oh, sounds like you're like cracking your teeth. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. It's weird, right? I don't do it. I'm it just hurts saying. your teeth. <laughs> Spit it out. Way to go, sister. We finished. Now it's gonna start cooking. Four hours. Six. Six hours. <laughs> no. Go ahead. Come at me. So it says high for four hours, but we all know that the crock cooks cook faster. So I put it on six hours. I think we can pick. 
be ready about six o'clock. Alright, we made our way to the backyard by the pool. Tiff's, Tiff's in her happy place. Trying to get her shoulders in the shade, but her legs in the sun. That's not happening. Not happening. Ready? Bryce is ready to go in the pool. Do it. Oh, water's got my nose. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Um, got some new slippers? Yeah. <laughs> Does it feel weird? Jiggly. Should we try swimming with these? <laughs> you can try. Oh, into the pool. <laughs> oh, yeah? <laughs> it's really hard to get out of the water. My turn. You gotta push your foot in. I had to push it in? Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's fine. Water. It'll lose water. It'll lose water. Okay. Get your foot oh. in. That's good. That's good. That's good. Go. Put it in the water. Put it in the water. It's gonna shit. <laughs> It's weird walking. Yeah, walking so hard is. <laughs> Alright, so we moved over to the grass, playing a little bocce ball. If you guys have never played bocce ball before, basically you throw a little a little white ball, I forget what it's called, it's the P. You throw that, kind of makes the mark, and then each team gets two uh, two balls. You throw it closest one to the to the ball, gets the points. It's fun. It's a fun little lawn game. Alright. Bryce just stepped on a bee as his first bee sting. His first bee sting on the bottom of his foot? I don't see Like anything. mommy. This isn't there. Maybe. So I feel it. No, right there. As soon, I thought you dropped the ball on your foot. Yeah, the way your reaction was. Oh, like, it's right there, guys. Oh yeah, there's the bee. He did. He totally did. Step on it again. Kill it. Crush it. Crush it. Here, I got this. I got this. I got this. No, his finger's gone. It was in his. Foot. I don't care. Yeah. No, no, no. Just. Look at look at his butt. Look at his butt. It's like like. It's dying. Yeah. It doesn't, they die when they lose their stingers. Dang, dude. Oh, first you. time. So, my first ever bee sting, I stepped on one and it hurt that. Oh man, yeah, because he was carrying like six bocce balls in his hand trying to bring them to us. I thought he just dropped one. Because you did drop one when... Oh man. Does it hurt? That or it does, yeah, okay. Like I could see where the stinger sting went in, but it hurts all around it. Yep, it'll yeah, hurt. It's because it's like venom. Oh yeah, there it is. Yep. Yep. You can see that little dot right there. Did you, like you saw it and then you accidentally stepped on it? No, I just stepped on it. And then, no, oh. it felt like, um, I felt like a little sticker just went into my, my foot and then it started hurting more and it wouldn't like I was shaking my foot and it wouldn't come off and I looked at it, it was a bee. <laughs> oh did you shake the bee off your foot? Like the bee was stuck no, to your I, I did that. I like pushed it off with my hand. Oh man. Is it burning? Is it burning? Yes. What is that what, what's it feel like? I don't know. I've never I've never been I've never been somebody bee. And you? Do? No. No, you didn't either. Yeah. Just saying, you have yeah, it. You... It hurts. Mm. Is it burning, stinging? Like what kind of Burns. Burns. Well, it's been about five minutes, ten minutes. No, no hives. So I guess you're not allergic to bee stings. That's good. Good to know. <laughs> you can see the spot right there. 
Is it you said it's like burning over here though? Yeah, like so over here. That's weird. Yeah, you can see the spot right there. Bummer, dude. All right, fast forward a few hours later. We're showered, we're clean, we're chilling. Dinner is smelling very good. It's about that time. Tiffany just threw on the last layer of cheese on the top, and that kind of melt and get bubbly. And it's time to serve. Bryce is upstairs playing some Fortnite. That's what he's been itching to do. Sierra's chilling on the couch. Tiffany and I are in the kitchen, unloading, loading the dishwasher, that sort of thing. Ready to eat dinner, I'm starving. Oh, it's time. Look at that. Oh my god. It. Yeah, it looks like lasagna, but it's like Mexican lasagna. I'm so excited. It's thick. What is it, Bryce? <laughs> oh yeah. Threw little green onions on top for garnish, flavor, and looks. Tiffany dropping some food for baby. Baby's like, dinner time, dinner time. Baby, are you hungry? Are you gonna eat? Maybe? I gave you a big breakfast, I don't know. Good? Mm hmm See ya. Well guys, uh, an abrupt ending to our evening. Uh, Tiff and the kids ended up going upstairs and doing their own thing until they went to bed. Um, I caught up on some things on my phone and I actually watched a TV, an episode of TV that I, I never do, I never watch TV. Um, but it was nice to just chill and I'm like ready for bed, I'm like ready to pass out. So thanks so much for watching. Hope y'all, hope your mothers had a fantastic Mother's Day. Uh, tomorrow's Monday, we kick off another week. Kids only have two more weeks of school left, so the countdown is on for summer break. We'll see you guys then. Vlog on.